Hi guys, once again, welcome to an hour with Jesus. This one hour, we're going to put aside everything and come and sit in the presence of God. As we have been doing this in the past, this is a prayer with a difference. Prayer of uh, just coming into his presence and communing with him. Most of the time we come to the Lord for a time of prayer with our needs and our requests. But this time, for the next 59 minutes, we're going to sit in his presence and just invite the presence of God to come into your house, come into your board, come into your heart, come into your life. And it's going to be in Tamil and in English. And also we'll be having a time of <clears throat> prayer. You, your link has been sent to you. If you ha still haven't uh, got that link, you can go into that link, the church online link, and then type your prayer request. You don't have to put your name. When that uh, page comes up, you can put any name or you, you can even go without a name and put your prayer request. We are not, going to, uh, we are not interested in knowing your name, but we want to know what your problem is, and we want to pray with you. And this evening, once again, the first Friday of this month, to come into his presence. As I said, it's going to be in English and in Tamil. So we're going to switch between both languages. Amen. Bow our heads and pray. Kangalai Moody, the Jabba Vala Ile Kalandu Kalampadiya. Idori Vitti Asamana Jabba Nera. அமர்ந்திருக்க Move to a location where you can have your Bible or your device. You can refer to the scripture verses. Just sit in his presence. Even if you are not listening to me, the, the thing that I would like you to do is to really spend time with God. Invite him. Confess your sins. Ask the Holy Spirit to help you. The Spirit of the Lord is there for you always. This is a time for you to spend time with God. And uh, my brother, my sister, this, uh, this year, God gave us a promise. In Deuteronomy chapter 33 and verse 12, he said, The beloved of the Lord will rest secure in him. The high God surrounds him all day long and dwells between his shoulders. Oh, just sense the presence of God. He is no, he is not limited by distance. <laughs> Oh, we thank you, Father. You know, you, 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 you're not in the presence of anybody. So you can sing. You can sing a new song. You can just call on the name of Jesus. You can talk to him. You can spend an intimate moment with him. Oh, yes, Lord. Oh, we thank you, Jesus. Worship in mighty name. Oh, Oh, You can be filled with the Holy Spirit and pray. Ask the Holy Spirit to come and help you. Come on, connect with us. As we stand in His presence, this, this evening is about stepping into His presence. Stepping into his love, feeling his presence around you. 
you can feel his touch you can feel his presence in you in the very place where you are i don't know where you are which part of the world you are but let me tell you let me assure you when you call upon the name of jesus and say lord i just want that rest is there by the side of you to embrace you and give you that rest that you may be looking for today oh we thank you father as we quiet our minds settle down you know the things that runs in your mind just let it go i know many things have happened in this week many worries anxieties problems that you may be having இந்த கடந்த வாரத்தில் ஏற்பட்ட எல்லா பிரச்சனைகள் சோதனைகள் கவலைகள் க கண்ணீர் வேதனை அல்லாவிட்டால் ஏமாற்றம் எதிர்பார்ப்பு பயங்கள் எல்லாவற்றையும் பாதத்தில் வைத்து இயேசுவே உமக்கு நன்றி நன்றி என்று சொல்லுகிறேன் பிரசன்னம் போதுமையா Oh, we thank you, Lord. Oh, Shabbat Hadi. You know, we always expect results based on, our, on the answers, according to the answer that we expect from God. Some kind of results, some kind of answer to our prayers. There's always an expectation for a blessing, for a deliverance for victory for healing that's all good that's all good nothing wrong with that but there is something greater that i would like to lead you to something greater that i would like to take you into that is his presence his holy presence you know we are all excited about deeds we are excited about breakthroughs victory for our health our future prayers all that is good my brother my sister but there's something greater than that that is the presence that is something greater than the word something greater than the promises itself there is something greater than the very promise that the lord has given you in this year or in the years past something greater than that something greater than the testimonies that you have had ningalava kalavum ange vaalkaiyile anubavitha aashirvaadangal adishayangal adbhutangal saatchigal yen vaakku tattangalai vida melana oru idathile melana oru kaariyam undundu adha thaan avudeya presence oh jesus presence of father i love your presence oh lord oh rashade there are the deeds there are the promises that is the presence devunudi seigal kiriyal avudi vaakku tattam avudi presence பெற்றுக்கொண்டால் மட்டும்தான் தேவனிடத்திலிருந்து ஆசீர்வாதத்தை நாங்கள் பெற்றுக் கொள்ளுகிறோம் என்று நினைக்கிறோம் அல்லாவிட்டால் வாக்கு தத்தத்தை பெற்று அது கிடைக்கும் என்று காத்திருக்கிறோம் வாக்கு கொடுத்தவர் உன் அருகிலே வர விரும்புகிறார் He just wants to come into your life come into your presence oh yes lord we worship your mighty name god we sing your praises to you
Cause nothing in this world will satisfy Cause Jesus, you're the cup that will run dry Sing your presence Your presence is heaven to me Your presence is heaven to me Sing treasure of my heart Treasure of my heart and of my soul In my weakness you are merciful Redeemer of my past and present wrongs You're the holder of my future days to come Listen, your presence, Lord Your presence is heaven to me. Your presence is heaven to me. There's nothing like your presence. Your presence is heaven to me, oh Jesus. presence is heaven. Lord, this is what I desire today. Your presence is heaven to me. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Your presence is heaven to me. Oh, praise God. If this is your desire, Today you are in for a special treat from the Lord. If this is your desire, that is His presence, it is not the deed, it is not the miracle, it is not the answer to prayers, it is not even the promise, but it's the presence. Today it's about you seeking His presence, you stepping into His presence, you just desiring His presence, you can feel His presence. In the Nalile, Ange Nangal Dermundi a person at the Marandi, Dermund Kodutta Asirwa Dangalile, Kangale Paraka Vidagra. You know, many a times for Christians, and it can happen to anybody, we start focusing on the blessings, answer to prayers, and the promises rather than focusing on the presence or the Promise giver. Walk a kodutavari, not amal, third amal. Walk at the tatayo, walk at the tatin al kreta, sirva the tayo, jabatitkana maratre tayo, and the kangal mun maiti, walk a kodutavari marande budagra.
ஏசாய் திற்கசியின் புத்தகத்தில் ஒரு சம்பவம் நடந்தது அதை நான் உங்களுக்கு வாசிக்க விரும்புகிறேன் This is what is written in Isaiah chapter 6 and verse 1. In the year King Uzziah died, Isaiah the prophet says, he writes with his own words, In the year King Uzziah died, I saw. In the year King Uzziah died, I saw. Until that time Isaiah did not see, he saw something that he did not see until the king had died. உசியா மறித்து அந்த வருஷத்திலே மரணமடைந்த வருஷத்திலே அவன் ஒரு காரியத்தை கண்டான் அவன் ஜீவனோடு இருக்கிற வேளையிலே உசியா ராஜா ஜீவனோடு இருக்கிற வேளையிலே காணாததொன்றை கண்டான் அது இந்த அதிகாரத்திலே வேதாகமத்தை திருப்பிக் கொள்ளுங்கள் just refer to the passage in Isaiah chapter 6 in your bibles or your devices take your notebooks and keep it with you i got some promises about the presence of God this evening for you. King Uzziah was a very successful king. There were many kings in the history of the Old Testament in Israel and Judah. But King Uzziah was almost the second best king next to King Solomon. Solomon Raja Vukadutta Daga Mikavum Vettigaramana ஒரு ராஜா உசாயா ராஜா உசியா ராஜா சாலமோனின் காலம் தங்க காலம் என்று சொல்லப்படுகிறது உசியாவின் காலம் வெள்ளி காலம் என்று சொல்லப்படுகிறது கிங் சாலமன் ரூல் வாஸ் நோன் ஆஸ் த ரூல் அட் த கோல்டன் பீரியட் ஆஃப் இஸ்ரேல் வாஸ் சோ சக்சஸ்ஃபுல் பட் த வெரி நெக்ஸ்ட் சக்சஸ்ஃபுல் கிங் தேர் வாஸ் பீஸ் அண்ட் ப்ராஸ்பெரிட்டி was king uzziah king uzziah and everyone was focusing on king uzziah prior to king uzziah's time there were many bad kings and the people of israel and the prophets were crying out to god send us a god fearing king <clears throat> and king uzziah uzziah was an answer to their prayers uzziah raja vukku munbadaga anega rajaakal again தவறாக நடந்தார்கள் அல்லாவிட்டால் தேவ பயம் இல்லாமல் நடந்தார்கள் ஆகவே தேவ ஊழியக்காரர்கள் எங்களுக்கு ஒரு தேவ பயம் உள்ள ராஜாவை தாருங்கள் என்று கேட்ட வேளையிலே தேவன் அவருடைய ஜபத்துக்கு மாறுத்திரமாக கொடுத்தது உசியா ராஜா இந்த sitting upon the throne amen i saw the lord sitting sitting upon the throne in the past weeks the past months the past past years have you been focusing on the blessings the promises and the and the fulfillment of god's answer to your prayers have you failed to see or these things like king uzziah has come and blocked you from seeing god nee devane kaana mudiyada vadiki devan uyaravu munnadamana singhasanathile veechirukkiradai kaana mudiyada vadiki aashirvadangal un kangalai maraithirukkirada a brother my sister when king uzziah died isaiah saw the lord seated on the throne but until such time isaiah was seeing and watching and hoping and uh, placing every hope that he had on that successful king who was seated on the throne when king uzziah was dethroned or in the sense he died he was able to see god and this moment as you are seated in the presence of god who is seated on your throne 
உன் சிங்காசனத்திலே வீற்றிருப்பது யார் தேவன் கொடுத்த ஆசீர்வாதங்களா அல்லாவிட்டால் தேவனுடைய வாக்கு தத்தங்கள் கூட முதலிடம் படுகிறதா வாக்கு கொடுத்தவரை விட உன் கண்கள் தேவனை அந்த சிங்காசனத்திலே வீச்சிருக்க முடியாத வடிக்கு வீச்சிருக்கிறவரை காண முடியாத வடிக்கு உன் கண்களை மூடுகிறது என்ன அப்படியே தேவ சமூகத்திலே அண்ட் அவரே என்ன மன்னியம் என்று சொல்லுவீங்க Will you just spend a few moments just closing eyes and say Lord I'm sorry I've been focusing on my needs I've been focusing on my blessings I've been focusing on the on the family that you have blessed me with the the job that you have blessed me with Amen For you to see the majesty of God your enthroned king king Uzziah has to die what is your king Uzziah today who is your king Uzziah today what is it who is it who is blocking you from seeing the enthroned God in your life abhi edava samagathile உன் வாழ்க்கையிலே அந்த சிங்காசனத்திலே உன் உள்ளத்திலே உன் சிந்தனையிலே அந்த சிங்காசனத்திலே வீச்சிருக்கிற உசியா ராஜா யார் உசியா ராஜா எது அது பணமா பட்டமா அல்லாவிட்டால் அல்லாவிட்டால் தேவன் கொடுத்த இந்த தேசமா அல்லாவிட்டால் உனக்கு இருக்க ஐஸ்வர்யமா ஆதிக்கமா அல்லாவிட்டால் நீ படித்த காரியங்களா நீ குளத்திலே செய்து கொண்ட காரியங்கள் என்னால் முடியும் என்று நினைத்துக் கொண்டிருக்கிறாயா who or what is enthroned in your heart today just come into his presence and say ask the holy spirit to come and ask check your life so the holy spirit will reveal to you right now oh jesus who is enthroned in your heart today is it money is it your job your profession your husband your wife the love of your life maybe for many it's money for some of you it is you many of you say i can do all things full stop is that your life I can do all things full full stop but Paul says I can do all things things through Christ who strengthens me is that portion has been deleted from your life and you think that you have been a self-made man a self-made woman your success has come because of your achievement has that dethroned god from your life I'm talking to you my brother my sister this is a moment for you to check out as to how you feel about god who is that king huzaya in your life dethrone him what is that king huzaya in the in your life dethrone him so that you can see the majesty of the almighty god right now this very moment before we finish this hour with jesus is jesus the king of your life உன் வாழ்க்கையில இயேசு தேவனா இருக்கிறார அப்படியே தேவ சமூகத்திலே கண்களை மூடி சபிப்பம் is it a bad habit is it the addiction that you're having God is able to set you free. It's not about the blessings, not about the deeds, it's not about the promise. It is about the presence of the Almighty God. 
Jesus. தமிழிலே ஒரு அருமையான பாடல் உண்டு ராஜா உம் பிரசன்னம் போதும் ஐயா எப்போதும் எனக்கு போதும் ஐயா என்னோடு சேர்ந்து பாடுவீங்களா ராஜா உம் பிரசன்னம் போதும் ஐயா எப்போதும் எனக்கு போதும் ஐயா பிரசனத்தை கேட்டு வேண்டுவமா ராஜா உங்க பிரசன்னம் போதும் எப்போதும் எனக்கு போதும் சொல்லுங்க ராஜா உங்க பிரசன்னம் போதும் எப்போதும் எனக்கு போதும் பிரசன்னம் பிரசன்னம் தீவ பிரசன்னம் ஆ பிரசன்னம் பிரசன்னம் தீவ பிரசன்னம் prasannam prasannam deva prasannam innum ummai hariyanume cholunga innum ummai hariyanume o innum ummai kitti சேரணுமே இன்னும் கெட்டியே சேரணுமே இன்னும் உம்மை அறியணுமே சொல்லுவமா இன்னும் உம்மை அறியணுமே இன்னும் கெட்டியே உம்மை சேரணுமே ஜபமாக Lord I want to get closer to you Lord I want to see your presence of father I want to see your love I want to feel your love just surrounding me today prasannam prasannam deva prasannam aha prasannam prasannam Deva Prasannam Hulagam Ella Chaloma Mayayaya Hulagam Ella Mayayaya Umman Bondre Pudumaya Chabamaga Unga Prasannam Ondre போதும் இசையாம் உலகமெல்லாம் மாயையா என் ஆசையெல்லாம் மாயையாம் பணத்தாசையெல்லாம் மாயையாம் உம்மன் பொன்றே போதுமையாவோ உங்க அன்பொன்று மட்டுமே சொல்லுங்க போதுமையா பிரசன்னம் பிரசன்னம் தேவ பிரசன்னம் ஆஹா பிரசன்னம் பிரசன்னம் தேவ பிரசன்னம் கரம் பிடித்த நாயகனே கரம் பிடித்த நாயகரே கையை விடாத தூயவரே என்னை கையை விடாத தூயவரே பிரசன்னம் பிரசன்னம் prasannam aa prasannam prasannam deva prasannam 
You know, for you to experience the presence and the love and the surrounding, the holy angels to come into your abode. All what you have to do is to just say, Lord, I want to, I want to experience your presence today. I just need your presence. I'm not worthy, but I'm willing to come and say, Lord, I'm sorry. And he will just come right by the side of you today. You can experience him. You know, there was a man called Moses in the Bible. And uh, I am always fascinated by this great man. And uh, he was always desiring the presence of God. But before I talk about uh, Moses, I would like to introduce another person who is also very special for me is Gideon. Gideon is one of the most important things in the world. Judges, the book of Judges, chapter 6, Nyaya Dipadikal in Puttaka Maharav the Digaratthile Kana Padukrathil. So Judges, chapter 6, goes like this. And um, verse 11. Now the angel of the Lord came and sat under the terabyte of Ophah, which belonged to Joshua of Abiezet. While his son Gideon was beating out wheat in the wine spread to hide it from the Midianites. So Gideon was afraid of the Midianites. He chickened out. He was not a bold and a person who will go out and lead people. He was afraid. He was hiding from the Midianites. And then this happened. Verse 12, and the angel of the Lord appeared to him and said to him, the Lord is with you, O mighty man of valor. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I just want you to receive this as a prophetic word for you today. The Lord is with you, O mighty man of valor. The Lord is with you, you mighty woman of faith. The Lord is with you. Yes, Gideon had his fears. Yes, Gideon was not having enough faith. Yes, Gideon doubted everything, what has happened in the past and the promises that was given to the people of Israel. He had questioned it. The very next verse talks about it. But my brother, my sister, the Lord appeared and said, you mighty man, you mighty woman of valor, you mighty ma man, a mighty woman of valor, of faith, this is what the Lord is telling you. <laughs> and verse 13 is pretty funny. And Gideon said to him, please, sir. In a, all, all these years, I, when I read this passage, I say, oh, Gideon said to him, please, sir, excuse. Or if the Lord is with us, why, 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 why this? But today I thought like, okay. Then Gideon said to him, please, excuse me. Because the very few other words what he had said, if the Lord is with us, why has this all happened to us? So the angel comes and uh, the Lord comes and tells him, hey, mighty man of valor, and he's hiding in fear because the Midianites have come and over and over again sort of destroyed everything and looted them. And he has come to his end of his faith. He has come to a point of disappointment. He has come to the place of giving up. He has come to a place of even, you know, not believing in the promises and the, and the stories that were told by his ancestors about the mighty works what God has done. And the, the angel of the Lord or the Lord comes and tells him, hey, oh mighty man of valor. And he said, please, what do you mean? Excuse me? If the Lord is with us, why is that all this is happening? Why are all these, all his wonderful deeds that our fathers recounted to us saying, did not the Lord bring us out of Egypt, but now the Lord has forsaken us and given us into the hands of Midians. 
But no! But now, my brother, my sister, how do you feel right now? I'm like Gideon. But no, things are not working the way I expected it to happen. But no, today as I, as I listen to this message, as I join this prayer group, as I look at the circumstances and situation around me, but now, ippoludu en valkai ilai, ippoludu en nilai ilai, thithi on cholugiraan, hella nalladu thaan, ange vallamai ullla unai parakrama sali enni cholru ingle, anal kadanda kaal le solla patta kari engal ellam enge, ippoludu en nilai ippoludu irukkirudhe. Is that you? Is that you, my brother, my sister? Now? Yeah, now. Is not as good as you expect it to be. Un tatpo di nilai. Yellam. Because of this COVID-19, you have just lost your job or lost your, uh, you know, income. You, you're just worried about everything. Maybe you are living in a part of the world where still this COVID-19 threat is prevalent there. But now, but now my situation is this. God is speaking to you today. Amen. Verse 14, and the Lord turned to him and said, Go in the might of what you have. Go in that might that you have. Verse 14, and the, and the Lord turned to him and said, Go in this might of yours and save Israel from the hand of the Midianites. <clears throat> Verse 15. <clears throat> Verse 15. And the Lord said to him, But I will be with you, and you shall beat the Midianites. Verse 15, the Lord said, I will be with you. Almighty oh, man of valor, yes, now your situation is bad. Your situation is not the, the ex most favorable expectation that you had. But I will be with you and you shall strike the Midianites as one man. So God's promise for you today is His presence. God gave his promise of his presence to Gideon. Gideon ke devan thanudi prasnate vaakutatta mai kodutar. God gave his presence as the promise to Gideon. Read that verse again verse 15 but I will be with you and you shall strike the Midianites. And, and the, I like that verse, like, you know, but I will be with you. So God says, forget about the past, but, yes, these things have happened. Yes, the Midianites have come and, you know, um, destroyed everything. The, the locust and the canker worm has destroyed everything. Maybe you lost your situation. Maybe your relationship is in a bad way. Maybe your health is in a bad way. Maybe what you are going through right now is not the best that you expect. But the Lord says, but now... I will be with you. I will be with you. Amen. But I will be with you and you shall. Listen to this, my brother, my sister. This is the prophetic word for you. Write it down and confess it with me. But I will be with you and you shall overcome in Jesus' name. But I will be with you and you shall win in the name of Jesus. And I will be with you and you shall be successful in the name of Jesus. I will be with you and you will break that addiction that you are going through right now. I will be with you, say the Lord, and your financial difficulty will be changed in the name of Jesus. I will be with you and your marriage will work in the name of Jesus. I will be with you and you will pass the exam that you are struggling with. I will be with you and the Lord says I, your family will survive I will be with you and you will find that job that you are looking for I will be with you and I will heal you I will be with you and I will give you rest I will be with you and you will be free from that suicidal thought that 
you may be going through right now. Receive it in the name of Jesus. The Lord said, but Gideon, I will be with you. My presence will go before you. My presence will surround you. Yes, you are not the best person. You have gone through all the difficulties. You didn't have faith of the, uh, you know, the, for you to sort of accomplish great things. It is not about that. But the presence of God can make all the difference that you may be going through. <laughs> நான் உன்னோடே கூட இருப்பேன் ஒரு மனுஷனை முறியடிப்பது போல நீ மீதியானியரை முடியறுப்பாய் அகே நான் உன்னோடே இருப்பேன் நீ வெற்றி பெறும்படியாய் நான் உன்னோட இருப்பேன் உன் வாழ்க்கையிலே உன் பழக்க வழக்கம் அல்லாவிட்டால் அந்த கெட்ட பழக்கங்களை விடுவிக்கும்படியாய் உன்னுடைய அந்த பணக்கும் முறையிலே உனக்கு வெற்றி தரும்படியாய் நான் உன்னோட இருப்பேன் உன் திருமணம் வெற்றி பெறும்படியாய் நான் உன்னோடு இருப்பேன் அங்கே உன்னுடைய வேலையிலே உனக்கு உயர்வு கிடைக்கும்படியாய் நான் உன்னோடு இருப்பேன் உன்னை சுகமாக்கும்படியாய் உன்னோடு இருப்பேன் உனக்கு சமாதானம் கொடுக்கும்படியாய் உன்னோடு இருப்பேன் என் வாழ்க்கையை அழித்து கொண்டால் என்ன என்று நினைக்கிற என் அன்பு சோதனை சௌதரியே உன்னோடு இருப்பேன் என்று சொன்னது அவர் அவர் உன்னை விட்டு விலகுவதும் இல்லை அவர் விட்டு பிரிவதும் இல்லை என்று வேதம் சொல்லுகிறது ஆகவே உன்னோடு இருக்கிற தேவன் உன்னை விடுவிக்க வல்லவராய் இருக்கிறார் உங்களுடைய ஜப குறிப்புகளை நீங்கள் இப்பொழுது எங்களுக்கு அனுப்புங்க கோயிங் டு தட் சர்ச் ஆன்லைன் சைட் ஜஸ்ட் கிளிக் தியர் தேர் இஸ் அ ப்ரே நீட் பாக்ஸ் ஜஸ்ட் கிளிக் தியர் யூ டோன்ட் ஹேவ் டு புட் யர் நேம் தியர் We don't need to know who you are, but you just put your prayer request and we're going to pray. We're going to pray right now. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The God of breakthroughs, God who was with Gideon, is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Wherever you may be, the God who answers prayers, he's right there for you. There are a few prayer requests that have come has been a lady in canada who has asked for prayer i don't need to know your name or you know whatever your situation may be i if you were there if you are joining us today the lord is setting you free right now we're going to pray in the name of jesus christ of nazareth so wherever you know if if, if you are affected by the situation or if you are if you are if you are sick just put your hand on that um, you know affected part of the body right now right now we're going to pray in the name of jesus amen yesu vi naamathil ange vyadhi pettavargala irukkalam ange neengal andha jaba kurippugalai neengal engalukku ippolude anuppalam endha jaba kurippugala irundhalum ange neengal engalidathil anuppugira velayil adukkaga naangal jabikkiram ange ungalude peyargalai neengal poda vendi avasiyam illai canada theshathil irukkira andha sahodari kai the saudri ka nangal chebikkum yesu vin naamathile lord i don't know what the situations the circumstances are but i don't need to know all i need to know is that you are a god who answers prayers and lord in the name of jesus christ from nazareth you are a miracle working god you send your word and heal that situation heal that lady lord that sister lord lord i pray that even as she is praying right now she be healed in the name of jesus even she may be watching it later during the time uh, situation <clears throat> lord i pray that you will touch her and heal her in jesus name in jesus name hallelujah oh thank you father there is another person in in the from from the uk united kingdom who has asked for prayers through one of our believers sent this request and wherever you may be the lord is setting you free The Lord is setting you free in Jesus name. I don't know in which part of the UK you are in. But you are watching us today. I pray that the Lord will completely give you deliverance. Right now this very moment. Oh, in the in the London it's about like 11:47 a.m. at the moment. It's almost noon time. So if you are watching us you joining us the god of gideon the god who said to gideon i'm going with you i'm sending you 
The God who promised Isaiah when he saw the majesty of God. The same God is here with you. You can just ask the Lord to touch you and heal you right now. So whatever your situation may be, I don't know. But I'm praying the Lord knows. Even before you could utter a word, he knows exactly what you're going to say. So he knows your heart. Jesus did not come in search of Christians, my brother, my sister. He came in search of you. He came in search of people like you and I who are not worthy. I'm not standing here because I'm worthy. I'm not standing here because I'm righteous. Christians are not worthy. The Christians are not perfect, but we have been forgiven. So you can ask the Lord, Lord, forgive me. I need your touch. You can feel the touch right now. You know, just uh, a week ago, we had a prayer meeting uh, online and we were praying for a particular person on another part of the world. And uh, there was a prayer request that was brought in. As we were praying, the Lord touched that person and completely healed. We have a wonderful testimony. It just happened last week. The doctors have given up. Had a back problem. And uh, because of that slip disc situation, there was a depressed sp uh, spot on her back, on that person's back. And that he or she was healed completely. I don't want to share names here. Completely healed. She was not even watching it live. She was just watching the recorded program. And the Lord touched her and healed her. Amen. You can be the next person. You can have that experience today. God is no respecter of person. Angge kadang tu waram dewan orang puri ad pudat teh cedah orang puri desa tu le orang mereka jabit tu walai le angge mudgli iran tu biadi ad dewan thottu kunama kena adat tu nyanyik kelamai seidi ad kertu kondir kira walai le angge kalit tu le orang nerti chatam kertu dam apu kalit tu le iran tu nope angge kadang tu sen tu abr chunar yatniyo warshengel kepin badak na nama idia ad tungin ayan badak amen dewan indro mat pudam cegira. Even today, God is in the business of doing miracles and he will do it for you today before you go out of this place, before this service ends. There's so one more person whom I'm going to pray for as a prayer request from Australia. As a stomach pain that this uh, person is going through. They've gone for some test and they're so worried about this uh, pain that uh, he or she is having. And she, uh, she or he lives in Australia. Will you join me, my brother, my sister, to pray with us? Oh, thank you, Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you said whatever you ask in my name, you will give. Lord, thank you for that healing that you have brought upon that lady in Canada. Thank you for that person you have brought that healing or deliverance in, 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 the, in the country of UK. Lord, Thank you, Lord, for that person who is in Australia who sent that prayer request. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord, you said to Gideon, I will go before you, I will go with you and turn that situation. Lord, for Gideon it was a circumstance that he had needed breakthrough. <clears throat> in these dear people's lives, it may be a sickness or a relationship problem, whatever it may be. And even though you have not sent your prayer needs to us, this very moment I'm going to pray for you, my brother, my sister. So pray in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Ask and call upon the name of Jesus, the same God who is doing amazing miracles in our, in our prayer meetings, in the midst of us. He's... He's no respecter of person. In the world, I will not be able to do this. 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 Andabre, ini mereka lihat kerja, gedam, yadu yang itu teri ada. Abang itu terapi kalau yadu yang itu teri ada. Nir, atputam seyam. Adi seyam, sorry, seyam. Father, I pray. I don't know where they are, what their problems are, but you know exactly what they are going through. Lord Jesus, I pray that you will go and surround them with your love and your presence, and let them feel your presence, your touch, and be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Get in touch with us. Share your testimonies. And before I finish, just. Seven more minutes to go. One last final point. 
Oh, praise the Lord. I was talking to you about Moses. He's a great man of God. Something that the Lord loved about him, he understood the importance of God's presence in his life. He understood the importance of God's presence in his life. And uh, Exodus chapter 33 and verse 13 onwards, God was uh, saying, hey, Moses, I'm not going to come with you guys because they were, you know, traveling through the wilderness 40 years. And some of the people of Israel, they just went against God's, uh, you know, uh, ways and angered him. And God said, I don't want to be in your presence. I, won't, I don't want to work with you all. Just, just, you know, you go, I'll send an angel. And Moses said, no, Lord, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to really seek your presence. I want to seek your presence, Lord. And he said, Lord, please, verse 13, verse 13 of 33, this is how he says, listen to this very carefully. Please show me now your ways. Please show me now your ways. That I may know you in order to find favor in your sight. So he's asking God to show his way. Show God's way. And then the next way says, says he said, you know, my presence will go with you and I will give you rest. Moses said, God, show me your way. The very next word, God responded and said, my presence will go with you. So, God's presence is the way. God's presence is the way. Remember that. Moses wanted the presence of the way of God. God said, my presence will go with you. Right. Verse 16. For how shall it be known that I have found favor in your sight? I and my people, it is, is it not in your going with us? His presence will make you distinct. And he says, how shall it be known that I have found favor in your sight? I and your people, is it not in your going with us? Is it not you showing us the way? Is it not by your presence with us? So that we are distinct, he goes on to say, so that we are distinct, verse, verse 14. I and your people from every other people on the face of the earth. So Moses says, when your presence comes with me, Lord, that proves that we are distinct, we are special. If you want to be a distinct person, seek the presence of God. If you want to be special in the sight of others, seek the presence of God. If you want to be famous like Moses, seek the presence of God. If you want to be someone in your life, seek the presence of God. Because Moses said, how shall people know that you are with us? How shall we be treated as distinct, special? Someone, some group of people, even today, generations are talking about, it is because Moses desired the presence of God. You know, as a verse in the Bible, Devandiya Prasunathya Mose Virumbinan, Devan Avanakke, Devandiya Valiyay Mose Kertan, Anam Mose Ki Devan Avandiya Prasunathya Kertan. Psalms 103 and verse 7. Sangeetam Nuti Mundi Yale. He made known his ways to Moses, his deeds to his people. He made known his ways to Moses and deeds to his people. Abartam valigale mosekam tam kiriyale istumel putre rukkum thariya padinar. John chapter 14 and verse 6, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth and the life. So if you are seeking his presence, Moses sought the way of God. God said, my presence will be with you. That very way, that very presence came down and dwelt among us. And he is our way maker. Jesus is your way maker. Jesus is your redeemer. And this, uh, this uh, moment, we're going we're gonna to close this prayer for, with this prayer, or song rather, he's our way maker. Jesus is your way maker. Once we have sung that song, my brother, my sister, in his presence, God will lead you. Fear not. Join this, uh, join Chamal and uh, Sam as we sing this song. He's our way maker. Jesus is your way maker. Amen.
Sing that one more time. You are here, moving in our midst. I wo- worship you. I worship you. You are here, working in this place. Working in this place. I worship you. I worship you. Let's sing you are way make. Cause you are way make miracle work. Promise keep light in the darkness. My God, that is who you are. So you are way make miracle work. Promise keep light in the darkness. My God. That is who you are, cause that is who you are, that is who you are, that is who you are. Amen. That is who you are. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus is the way maker, the miracle maker. That is who he is. The Bible says, He is the way, the truth, and life. Moses desired the ways. He made known to Moses his ways. That is the very presence of God. Moses asked for the way. God said, my presence will go with you. And as as we come to a close, my brother, my sister, seek the presence of God. Seek the presence of God. That way, that presence, that God who was with Gideon, the same God whom Isaiah saw enthroned, he became flesh and dwelt among us. He said, ask in my name, I will give you rest. I will set you free. I will deliver you. I'm going to close in prayer. Whatever your need may be, get in touch with us. We would love to continue to pray for you. Father, once again, we thank you. Thank you for your presence. Lord, I pray that their prayers will be answered, your presence will be the answer to all their struggles that they may be going through. Let there be deliverance in the lives of these people, victory in the name of Jesus, that they are special because they have sought your presence. We thank you, we give you glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Seek his presence always. Get in touch with us. And we would love to hear from you and continue to pray for you. God bless you once again for joining with us today. God bless you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Shamal. Thank you, Sam. It's one hour.